Hey YouTube, I got another video review for you today. This one is from a company by the name of Bolt Lock. Um, and what they are is a, a lock company that takes your ignition key from your truck and it allows you to um, use it in all their different types of locks that they have. And they've got these six foot coiled uh, locks and uh, you can use them for your kayaks. You can use them right here for these uh, gas cans. And uh, they've got this pin lock here that hooks onto your coupler. And they also have, uh, I don't have it installed, but they have a uh, hitch uh, pin down there. And so um, another thing that they also offer is these paddle locks for your uh, toolboxes. I don't have mine installed yet because it's a new toolbox and I figured I would wait till the lock got a little worn out and, and switch them over. But uh, anyways, they just uh, basically uh, pull this off and uh, mount the other one in with some pop rivets and you're able to take your, your truck key and, and use it to unlock any of these uh, bolt locks. And I'll show you here in just a second uh, just how how all that works and you can see that I've got one here on the cooler and it's also hooked to the uh, hydro caddy and then I have another one that's hooked to my uh, kayak cart and my creek cooler you can see right here and uh, on this other side uh, I don't really have one on this side but you could uh actually use it to tie your your kayaks off here in the front and back i've just got mine tied off here in the front so that's good enough for me but uh anyways i'm going to show you how to uh use these locks and uh give you a few features on them let you make the decision for yourself this is something that you're you're interested in all right my buddy jake's gonna pop this uh weatherproof cap off and uh on the inside you've got a stainless steel shutter basically it just shields uh the inside of that lock mechanism from water and keeps it from rusting and what you do is you take your your ignition key from your your truck and it just pops right off it's as simple as that and so uh you don't have to have a bunch of different keys for everything and uh you know show them here on this padlock uh, you just, like once again, pop that ignition key in there and, you know, it's no problem. And so everything locks up really easy. And same thing right here on this uh, coupler pin. If you want to show them on that one. You know, everything just uses that one key. Nice. And so makes it really simple. Uh, I'll start right here on the, on the um, coupler. Uh, this is a stainless steel pin that comes all the way through and uh, it's got these little grooves in it and uh, you can push it until it clicks and each click is like a, a quarter of an or an eighth of an inch increment and uh, you need to make it tighter and anyways uh, seems to work really good um, let's see on these uh, the first thing that I noticed when I pulled these out of the package was the uh, size of the shackle it's a uh, 5 16 uh, hardened steel uh, shackle. It's been chrome plated to uh, keep down on some of the rust. And then as far as the rest of the lock, it's got this, uh, you know, it's like a plastic or vinyl coating over it. So, uh, you know, it's not banging around nothing and, and scratching, scratching anything up. So that is a nice touch. Plus, you know, it cuts down on rust and all that. So anyways... All right, guys, uh, these uh, locks, they have a limited lifetime warranty on them. Uh, they're located in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. They're one of the largest producers of automotive locks in the country. And I'm going to take you inside, and I'm going to show you just how to uh, program one of these locks uh, so it uses um, your, your key for your truck. It's really simple. All right, guys, uh, I just wanted to bring you in the house and uh, show you how to uh, program one of these bolt locks whenever you get the bolt lock out of the package you'll flip it over to the bottom and it has pretty much a sticker on there telling you hey warning you know don't stick anything in here because it'll mess it'll mess up programming the uh, the key so you just rip off the sticker and the little plastic tab there on the bottom 
And it's real simple. You just take your, your vehicle key and you slide it in here all the way in and then you turn it all the way to the right till the lock pops open. And as soon as the lock pops open, then you just pull your key out and it's programmed. It's that simple. I'll show you. I'm gonna go ahead and lock it back. You stick your key for your truck or car in back into the block. You just turn it and it pops open. It learns it the first time that you stick the key in and you rotate it, it the lock um, programs itself to that key. So it's really simple. And uh, I'm gonna go ahead and show you again here on the receiver lock. I said that I didn't have it installed. Um, I'm fixing to program it and go ahead and install it on my truck. So I just wanted to uh, pause it. All right, guys, we're back. We've got the uh, 5 8 receiver pin and the bolt lock. And I'm gonna show you how to program this one. You just pop the uh, weather connector off. And again, this one has the little warning label on there. You peel that off. And um, you've got a piece of plastic there. You just pop it out. Really simple. Then you take your truck key and you just stick it in there. And you twist it all the way to the right. And then you pull it out and it, it's learned the lock. It's that simple. All right, guys. Just wanted to show you that uh, it works. It pops the, the lock loose from the pin and uh, it goes on there really easy. There's nothing to it. And so you can tell that this, uh, this lock mechanism is really beefy. I've owned some of the Reese brand uh, locks and they're not nearly this solid here on the, the ends. Um, you know, I don't think there's anything that can't be broken into because a set of torches or a sawzall or bolt cutters can really get into most anything, but, uh, this would definitely, uh, prevent, um, or deter somebody, you know, if they've seen how heavy this thing was, they might think twice about trying to get into it. And if you put multiple locks on it, like what I've, I've done, um, then I, I don't think anybody's really going to bother it. Uh, the reason I got a couple extra padlocks is because I was going to take my safety chains that's on my kayak trailer. And every time that I go out, I was going to put two padlocks on both safety chains and, and padlock my kayak trailer to my truck. So that way, uh, not only will they, there be two padlocks on it, there will also be a coupler lock that's in the on the pin for the hitch. And so, you know, three locks basically... Um, would probably deter most anybody. I'm not saying that they can't get it off. I'm just saying that it's gonna, I'm gonna make it as hard for them as possible. So um, anyways, check out boltlock.com. I'll put a link in the description and uh, appreciate you uh, watching the video. And if there's anything you'd like to see me do a review on, please put it in the comments and make sure you like and subscribe to my channel and uh, talk to you guys later. Thanks.